So, not much without his wonder suit though, really. You know, you guys aren't much without your suits, eh? You're just the same as us. Just the same. Look, they're at primary school. Hold hands. We've got all the time in the world now with Chelsea's and we're actually going to do some benefits. I wonder how long that'll last for. Let's think about our economy for a little bit, shall we? We've had a number of arrests and the police have been very aggressive. I was a very disappointing to see. Standing beside a highly qualified psychiatrist that you're going to need once you realise what you've been involved in. And we do want the best for you, but it is time to wake up, brothers and sisters. Okay, so there's a bit of a squad out there. Hello, hello. We're on waving. He's over there, that side of the building. Bring out Cindy. Let's get her in the ring. Yes, I'll go around. Let's see how tough she the is. Oh, look, there's a trot. Uh, that looks important. Hey! 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 It's going to help you. Yeah. Your enemies are so it's, it's not outwards. Yeah. Come on! Yeah. Oh! 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 What are they doing? Oh. I think they have cornered the police are cornered on the other side now. They're going to try and use every So they, yeah. But they're little men. There's a group of little men where I'm pointing to my left. And a little bit of little men here too. So just watch the head henchmen. They're often a tall guy with black gloves that does a tap out. Hopefully they don't get tapped. So awesome. the police have started going around the other side, so the crowd is, is yeah, going both sides. Go home! So they're trying another okay, tactic, you got the but the crowd has been too good. They are calm and they're staying strong, they're not moving. I am so proud of them, so proud of them. Oh. Oh, she's over there. Oh, oh. Hey. Don't worry about the tents, brothers. There's plenty of those on trade me. I'll find you some. There's plenty more tents for you. We have the numbers. Remember that. They don't have any Let's be peaceful though, because these guys just think they're doing they're their job, but they're, oh, they're deceived. They're, they're trying to provoke them, so stay calm, tell them. Let's be calm. Oh, they can't hear. They're trying to <laughs> you serve us. You serve us. You serve us. You serve us. You serve us, 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 you they were standing there, just standing there shame. calmly. Look at the bully. Shame! 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 shame. That's disgusting. Shame! Stop it! Shame it! Shame! 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 Fuck you!
Well, they just said they have a paramedic on hand, aren't they kind? You get out! Hands off! Leave them alone! Leave them alone! Leave them! Shame on you! Shame on you! Shame on you! Shame on you! Stop now! You Jacinda is going to keep you safe, but she isn't. Believe you me. And everyone's recording this disgusting, disgusting show in front of us. Okay, watch out to the left. That woman's just calling in the extra punters. Look out where I'm pointing. She's a shifty ass. Watch the numbers. Police, you are not doing your job. This is not policing. You know it. Stop deceiving yourself. It's time to wake up, guys. Here's some more reinforcements. The guys with the black gloves are the more vicious ones. You're fired. They're more vicious. I hope you haven't got a knee on that brother's neck. Tell them to the police to stand down. Stand down now. Oh, yeah. How many twists on her arms, guys? Oh, that woman. That looks like unnecessary control and restraint to me, and I've seen plenty of it. Shame on you! You police have turned into thugs overnight. That's disgusting. I know the paramedics coming in. That's Mate, disgusting. you should have prevented it. You yeah. shouldn't have stood by. You are complicit. You will be held responsible. Don't make out you got sympathy now. No. It's a joke. That's why everyone hates the police. Yeah, you need that, sister. Yeah, yeah. Take over, take over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go for it. Go for it. Yeah, yeah. Go for it. Go for it. Go for it. Come on. Leave her alone. She's done nothing wrong. Stop showing sympathy when it's far too late. She is standing for her children. She is fighting for her children. Stop it! How does that feel? All Stop you police, it. you are fired! Stand down immediately! The people are firing you! Amen. What have you done? Go, sister. You are hurting your own people that you swore an oath to protect. Amen. Look what you have done. Look at that. I hope you are proud of the people you serve up here. your service and your post. How many stripes have you got, brother? Take your cap off. You serve us. He put his cap on for that. It's Hand not about cap. health. This is not about health. Hey, sir, where's your mask? Come on. You're supposed to put it on. You might get on my prom. You're so caring that about people's going to be too health. busy with that heavy pack and trying to minister to brothers he's just kissed to the dirt. Look at this guy. He's just kissed the dirt. We're proud of you, brother, but we're not proud of you, policeman. Yeah, we're well, not proud of you, police. To take him down. It took six to take this brother down, though. That's how tough you guys are. Oh, you're so and caring. Look at it. You're so caring about people's health, aren't you? Oh, gosh. I don't know what to say. I'm so angry. So am I. Oh, oh fuck. Yeah, yeah. You 
well striped police must be very proud of yourself. Attacking the people. Attack. Attacking the tangata whenua. How the proud do you feel? Watching. Your mothers will be watching. The people will be watching. Channel 1 and Channel 3 won't report. But what's new in that? Oh, look, two paramedics to help a woman now. They're oh, an hour too late. They jump to it? Oh, After look, they're, they're so they caring. They're, you're so caring, aren't you? You're a disgrace to your profession. Toss your paramedic badge down. It's worth nothing. Oh, you're ministering Do to the him. Right thing, mate. He was the one causing it. What a joke. Do the right thing. He's got your Do the right thing. So just watch here guys where I'm pointing, there's a cluster of specials and a bit of a hold. There's a bit of a cluster there of the, the brains of the organisation. I'm not sure how big the brains are. Make fun of the Smurfs. You have to, you have to. Yeah, here we go. Watch, there's a tap here where I'm pointing, guys. Can you see me pointing? There's a little line of some tappers. They're just trying to move forward. Yeah, happy with yourself, Sam. Please start taking photos of the, the horrible work you're doing on the people. You with the big cap on. Are you a civil or actually police? Because it's a disgrace to your badge if you're a police. I can see why I left prison nursing with the way you guys are carrying on. <laughs> That's good. It's great to be associated with Did anything public service. I know. She's only it's just been found. It's not public service at all. She's it's just Jacinda service. Oh, in lip yeah. service. She doesn't listen to the people. She doesn't care about us. She wants to ruin our country and she's had a really good go so far. So there's some guy here itching to do a bit of work on you guys. He's got his taser at the ready. He's probably got a taser at the ready. He's got a slightly different shirt on. I don't know whether that's combat or what that is. Where is he? He's at the top of this line here. Riot squad. He's a tall that's guy. It. He's a riot, riot squad. squad. Oh, they pulled the riot squad in. Oh, that one He's back special. there that's He's standing here. out talking. What's going on down there? Looks like a bit of commotion down there. Oh, oh wow. Hey, I think we have a victory here. We have a victory because the police are leaving the other side. And they are cheering, the people are cheering over there. By this lamppost here, okay? Just to the left of that. Thing one and thing two. Thing one and thing two have just arrived. What's happening? Okay, so they have left. They were cornering the um, okay. campus. In the words of Dr. Zeus, around the other the side, and no I think they school. have <laughs> talked them into leaving. I might just be a person. I love Dr. Zeus. I love Dr. Zeus. Yes. So do I. He was a good guy. And oh he my got God. Yes, he did. What's the word coming to if Dr. Seuss books the council? Bringing out new ways to have sodomy. <laughs> this is not policing, guys. This is some other faux measure for our faux Prime Minister with all those teeth. It's Big Farmer. Remember, anyone big with farmer that amount of teeth can never tell the truth. It's Big Farmer Thuggery. She's been feeding from a good trough. She has a bit and bridle at home. And I'm not being nasty. I'm just calling it as I see it. I'm so proud to be a policeman. Yep, do you feel the proud pride of your badge? Do you feel this is what it's all about? Turning on your do you own feel people. the love of the people? Disgusting. Do you feel the love of Jacinda? So there's a real line here, guys. Is here one, two, three, four. You must be a real threat. That's the world's threat. Sorry, guys. The protesters must be a real threat because they've got lines now. So this next farmer's thuggery at its worst. He needs to just be looking back in the mirror. He might see himself. So we have got a whole lot of supporters on the banks here supporting them. A couple of tents. Yeah. <laughs>
in a cold. Maybe the police just want your tents. <laughs> Maybe they want them for Easter holidays so, so, or the summer season. Hey, yeah. two shots for summer for you. Did you get your festivals? Or are you waiting for your booster for February? And for some other occasion? Maybe there's another one for Anzac Day. Oh, you're less we forget from the out there. Now's your chance because all the police are here, okay? <laughs> if you go down to that door, I've just been there. Okay, so the team <laughs> look like they have gone down there, so maybe they can be heard better. Oh, are you talking about helping the police? No, helping the people on the point. Oh, no, but they're up here, so they have to arrest them. Okay, so they can Come over here, mate! So this is Lorraine, Wellington, Parliament Grounds, New Zealand. Uh, please share. Uh, we have a standoff with the police here. Share it worldwide. We Freedom Fighters are standing our ground. Um, I'm so proud. I'm so proud. They are not moving. There's a few hundred police, but there's thousands of us. We came back because we're too close to that guy. Yeah, so yeah. You know, it's lovely. It's much better up here because so you get a full view here. up here. So we've got some lines here. Here, a bit of a line where you can see I'm pointing. Here, there's a cluster. We just got to watch the tall punters with the black gloves because they mean business. This guy here is a bit of a menace at the front. It's very loud, eh? Over here. Dennis. Dennis the menace, apparently. <laughs> is it still feeling like policing, guys, turning on your own people who are peaceful, who just want body, bodily autonomy, who just don't want to have medicine because Cindy wants us to take it? And maybe because it's not researched and there's no long-term studies, and maybe because people are dropping dead, we don't want it. <laughs> maybe. Apparently, though, <laughs> we're not allowed to have that freedom. Apparently, we have to toe the line because it's about choices and consequences. A few of you have heard that one over the last few weeks. I think it's national radio rhetoric. So, tall guy over there looking to do some work landing on the post. He's aligning his punters. Ah, uh, him. You've got to watch him. And the guy. There's a few that are about six foot five, just to give them a bit of advantage and him he looks dangerous <laughs> who's at the parliamentary security oh no it's not the parliamentary Sorry, security it's the last phone we Cindy she won't come out because she's a bit of a pussy she's a bit of a sookie puppy I'd like to see her in the ring I'd go with a bridle me lose my internet you do <laughs> Numbers are still gathering on our side, which is really awesome. So even though the police look like they're threatening and bullying because they've got these fluoro vests that makes them stand out, Tally actually, Teletubbies, we've got the numbers. <laughs> and we've got some strapping, strong, handsome right. men who have their nuts intact yep. and are ready, I won't say to rumble, because we don't want to do that, but they're ready to stand strong. And actually there's some strong wahine there as well. Yep. Who are sick of you standing on our whenua and yeah. stomping on our wairua. Because that's not okay. So this guy here, still in that first line, want to watch them. He might be being extra kind. Yeah, he might be being extra kind. Because it's kindness that counts. <laughs> <laughs> I just know how much this is all costly. <laughs> you 
how much does this day cost for you guys? Is this um, all on overtime. What, what's the be risk benefit analysis of this, and uh, how much how much is a real cost of standing and and here against people who just want their freedom, just want their voice heard? Sick of you silencing us. Media got a hundred and three million. How much the police get? As much? You've got to work harder, mate, to get more money. So you've got 103 million for media that doesn't cover the truth. So, uh, yeah. Well, more more um, columns coming, Gabrielle. What's happening? More, more columns. Yeah. They're definitely they're going to riot. It. Yeah, they're going to push, I think. Then we should yeah. maybe get behind them. <laughs> Yeah, I, 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 guys, so there's a, a clustering here. I think they're going to wait for a bit of a nod from this guy with the three stripes. Yeah. It's a lovely self-identification. Oh, there's one over there too. Pulled out the big guns for you today. You should feel pleased. You should feel honoured. Okay, so we now have one, two, three, four lines here. Oh, we've got some rubber gloves coming out. I'm not putting my hand up to be examined. <laughs> I'm the nurse. I don't want to examine you. So just watch over here. Just watch that area there. I don't know. There's a bit of a tap out with the brethren. Well, I think it's because some cracking of the necks. This is really disturbing. Oh my god, they're dragging him. They're dragging him. They're dragging him. Who have you got? Grandpa or grandma that you've got in a hard hold? Yeah. What are you doing? Is he paid? Gosh, guys. Dragging. That's ridiculous. So ask him if he wants to be examined afterwards, but no, straight up he looked fucked. He looked like he had no water. No, straight up he was like, damn. No, he wasn't even one of ours. No, you might need, you might need examination. Don't let him die in your custody. Don't him. let him die in your custody because we know that happens. Yes. Sadly. You know, actually, I heard at Arohata the other day there was a suicide. And it broke my heart because I was there for 21 years. And there was only one death in custody when I was there. And I thought to myself, that person will have died in the secure cells. And sure enough, that's where she did die. And I believe she had answered one of the COVID questions wrong. And she was being isolated. How cruel. How unnecessary. You know, the real cost of COVID is the deaths that are incidental. But apparently they don't line up for you guys. You're more interested who's died in a hospital on a ventilator. But that's not the truth. Because anyone over 80 on a ventilator is going to go. <laughs> and let's be honest, someone dying with a gunshot is probably not COVID. <laughs> In my humble nursing experience anyway. Well, I'm not sure about you. Not, not in a police way. <laughs> we don't need a degree to work out that one, do we? We just innately know this is wrong. And when are you guys going to stand up? Because you'll be suffering in those masks as well. Okay, so that guy's given a little gentle tap of the brothers here. Just watch him. Watch him. He's got some stripes. He's got some lapels. I, I need to go to Specsavers. I can't count how many stripes they've got now. I'm seeing double vision. They know how many stripes they've got. So we've got a few infiltrating for a bit of a tap out. So there's five lines, but again, you've still got the numbers, guys. Remind them it's been broadcasted around the world. Yeah, please share this widely around the world. This is Wellington, New Zealand, Parliament grounds, and we have a standoff. We have a, a couple of hundred people, or a couple of hundred police, I should say, and thousands of freedom fighters and campers. They've locked the gates. They have cordoned the campers off. Um, we've had a lot Those of um, police brutality horns, and eh? people taken away really and arrested. Okay. Telegram. Yeah, I'll try it. Or Gab's good as well. And they okay. can't be taken at all. Uh, we place? have a lot of courageous not, freedom fighters here who are standing their ground. They've got their backs to the police. They know that they may the next be the next one that's grabbed from the crowd. 
but they're standing firm. Yeah. And um, I like it. Um, I'm going to shut out of Facebook once Oh, yeah, yeah. You just get on that. And then you'll just write, oh my gosh, it's my gosh. Yeah. Okay, cool. Here's my people. Yeah, yeah. Totally. Yeah. I feel like something's going to pop off soon. Oh, they're ready. Ah, that looks like. Uh, it looks. Yeah. Oh, that's, I know. Thank you for the horns. Let's have some more. That's the real men. Thank you. Awesome. We need those. Okay, so just watch that tall brother. Six foot five, or oh, he's got a few of them around six foot five. They're ready for an opportunity. They want their stardom. They want to be on on the media. You're losing your breath in those masks. Gosh, it'd be as hot as hell. It's a shame you're not getting sprayed with that water to cool you down. It's a shame. Those stab proof vests would be really packing some heat too. I wonder if they've got some gel inserts. You need some slushies like they had at the prison. That was some really sensible uh, taxpayer spend. I think I contributed to that. <laughs> oh, dear. So there's obviously a signal that's going to go out here shortly because there's a couple of guys here looking for some work. Yep, they do need to wake up. You're right. Guys who are outside, I suggest you come in and just actually show the police what our numbers look like, even if you're up here, because maybe we can just surround them in a big arfie. Give them a lovely hug. Maybe that's what they're missing. Uh, they're past getting a hug. The police might need a bit of a hug, a bit of an embrace. That would be an interesting move, wouldn't it? If we all just went in to hug them. Yeah, it would actually. It's probably the right way to go, really, isn't it? Okay. Okay, we've had a peaceful protest here in uh, Parliament grounds for the last three days. They've been very peaceful. There's the black the sister. The black uh, guy just where was he? He's just where did he go? There's a guy in right for right again. Where did he go? What's the time? I haven't got a clue what the time is. Oh there, he's on there. He's uh, he's looking for a drop. You know, where's the police commissioner in this actually? He's a Christian. I don't actually think he'd be for this, surely. Surely he wouldn't want to come after unarmed people that just want to stand in their sovereignty and just be heard. Surely not. I don't think he's probably a good guy. Where are you? 
why are you not here? Have you not worked out who the enemy really is? Because it's not us. It's the people in the ivory towers. Oh, you're pointing at me. Oh, hello. As I said, you can't take much more off me. I've lost a lot. Hello. Sadly, not weight. <laughs> the cruel irony. Yes, it's hot work in that mask. You new recruits will need a breather. You've just probably come out of your training Good school. Good work, After your booster. After your booster. Well done. Well done. But we don't blame well done. you because you guys actually, it's really hard when you're starting out in a profession and someone's foots to your throat saying, if you don't do this, you're not going to be able to work. Really difficult, really hard to stand against that. It was really hard for me to stand against it and lose a thousand a week. Really hard. Really tough on my marriage. Really tough on my family. But sometimes you've got to do the right thing. This parliamentary security. This parliamentary security has never done so much work in all its life. These got boy, where these guys are they tapping it? They're done. These new recruits are totally done. The heat's just got them gone. That brother needs a hair clip. <laughs> Shivers. Police, have you got all day? Have you got better things to do with your time? Yeah. These guys are busy. You're important with your cap. How many stripes for you? Truckies give us some horns, that would be lovely for us. Okay, I'm going to have a break, guys. I'll be back with you soon. Oh, really? Paramedics, it's your time to shine. Someone's been injured. Would you trust them though with a mask on? I'm not on sure for if I'd trust you actually. For, for a and to cold. be honest, I think a lot of the key health professionals have left the industry. The ethical ones have the, left the room. Yeah. Yes. Does that surprise you? Because I'm the one that's going to stand there and say it's not okay to kill grandma and it's not okay to abort babies until birth. That's me. I'm the unpopular one. Jacinda was behind that bill. She thinks it's okay to take babies out till birth. Isn't that incredible? And says she's a mother. Unbelievable. She's a mother father. <laughs> a mother washer? Mother father. <laughs> No, the the elites actually call us useless feeders. Oh, here we go. There's a bit of work here on the left. Just watch him, like a hawk. Got it. Got it. So the elites call us useless feeders, and do you know they only want 500 million on the planet? And actually, you probably would have thought that was a conspiracy theory. But actually, we just call it a conspiracy now because actually it's a fact. Look up Klaus Schwab. Oh, and that's fine. <laughs> oh, battery. Sarah and Ian. Where's the heck is not there? Was it husband? Um, I just have a look. 
Sorted it out? Oh, awesome. Are we still working? So nothing's going to stop us. Well, we'll set a flat mattress. <laughs> now we found an alternative way. That's the horns of a real man. not men with diapers on their faces. You've taken your juice, that should have protected you. Do you still not feel protected or are we a threat to your health? Think about it, we're well, are you? Say, so, if you had your jabs, why are you still wearing your masks? I'll go and see if I can find them. You gonna be I here? I see Sarah down there. Tell them Doomfield, who, Jacinda, they've all no, said no. that masks don't work. They've all said that masks don't work. Okay, we are live in Wellington at Parliament Grounds. We have a standoff with the police, there's a couple of hundred of them. We've had a standoff all day and we have hundreds and hundreds of thousands of freedom fighters in campus here. Uh, we've had people dragged away, the police have been brutal, it's been quite shocking. Um, I've had a friend being dragged away just talking to a security guard. We need freedom fighters coming down to Wellington. We need you guys now. So it's a call for more freedom fighters to come to Wellington. Now, please. And we need everybody to share this widely, internationally.
Something down there. They're planning something. They're planning something down there. Imagine that colluding against your own New Zealanders. So sad. AA batteries and Sarah's gone to get some. It's the speaker that's oh, cool. not the speaker, the mic. Lovely people, there's a formation of our good police here having a bit of a corridor. Uh, maybe gonna duck up this side and maybe there's gonna be some movement this side. Yeah. So we're watching you brothers. We're watching you. Thank you everyone for travelling from far and wide. We appreciate you here in Wellington. And imagine how hard it is for us when every internet provider and social media platform tries to take us down, yet we still gather. Isn't that amazing? Bush Telegraph's pretty amazing, guys. Imagine if people were working with us instead of against us. How amazing that would be. Because we're not the enemy at all. In fact, we're people that want to uphold your rights too and don't want you jabbed when you don't need it. And it's of no benefit and it's all risk. And we don't want your kids jabbed and dying as well. But 
But when they fall over with heart attacks, you will know why. You will know why. It will be the shots. Interchangeable with another word that's spelt very similarly with an I. No good. Okay, so here we go, a little bit of a quiet. He coy up this side. They're coming from both sides. Go so, on. and this side on the left. So maybe there's a swap out here, but definitely right side. And definitely here a bolstering of the, the numbers. Hold the line, guys. You've actually got...